Electronica Veneta has developed a solar concentrator trainer specifically designed for educational needs. The aim of the equipment is to perform experiments on a solar thermal system using a parabolic trough collector to produce domestic hot water. Let us first have a look at how the water is heated by the solar power. The energy of sunlight is focused along the silver pipe to heat a fluid. At the same time, a photovoltaic panel produces the electricity needed to run a DC pump that conveys the cold fluid into the concentrator. Cold tap water is conveyed into a tank and heated by the collector heat transfer fluid and then used as domestic hot water. Let us now have a look at the main features of the equipment. This is how the workstation looks like. This is the control panel. And here we have the water tank and the solar station with DC pump. The water and heat transfer fluid inlet and outlet are positioned in the lower part of the frame, which is mounted on wheels for easy handling. Different counters and meters help us monitor the flow rate, temperature and pressure in key points of the circuit. This is the outdoor solar concentrator unit. It is mounted on wheels, so it is very easy to take outside. By means of a sun tracking device, the solar concentrator automatically finds the best orientation toward the sun thanks to the sensor you see on the right. The sensor on the left is needed for data acquisition. This is how the actuators operate. And this sensor measures the air temperature. The control panel can be connected to a PC running Windows for the data acquisition. The operation diagram is always at hand for consultation. Ok, let us switch on the system operating this switch. And select if we wish to power the DC pump via mains or outdoor photovoltaic panel. Let us also switch on the solar tracking device. And select if we wish to operate the device manually or automatically. If we choose to operate it manually, we can adjust the position of the collector operating these buttons. This portable thermometer will help us detect the thermal stratification in the storage tank. The manual guides us step by step into a variety of exercises. Let us now use the personal computer for the system supervision. Just glancing at the screen we can see in real time how the different power meters change in key points of the circuit and we can also observe the real-time trend of the acquired parameters by means of this graph. Thanks for watching this video. If you need more information or a quotation, please feel free to contact us.